This is home. And our roots run as deep as the love we have for this place. Owned by the same Cincinnati company for more than 70 years. And what matters to you matters to us. This is WCPO 9 News. We thank you for choosing us. I'm Evan Millward. Here's a look at some of the top stories at this hour. The man arrested in this morning's deadly shooting in Green Township now also charged in a deadly shooting this morning in Northside. Cincinnati police arrested Mark Henderson for the death of David Francie. Francie was found shot at an apartment complex on Georgia Avenue around 4.30 a.m. The other victim, Richard Kelsey, was found shot multiple times outside a house on Sydney Road in Green Township around 4.15. Cincinnati firefighters battled what they say was a stubborn fire this afternoon in College Hill. Crews were called to a home on Glenview Avenue around 1. There was smoke coming from the roof and the upper levels of that house. Cincinnati Fire says that fire was burning in tight spaces. That's why it was so hard to put out. Crews say no one was hurt. The cause of that fire is still under investigation. And it is a nine first warning weather alert day starting tonight into the start of your work week. A chance of severe weather overnight into Monday. Here's Taylor Nimmo. Taylor. Yeah, Evan, like you mentioned, that nine first warning weather alert day begins at 11 on Sunday night and will continue through 9 a.m. Monday as this line of showers and storms approaches the tri-state area and brings along some heavy rain, the potential for some strong winds and even potentially some strong to severe thunderstorms. Tonight, we've got a low of 52 and rain will arrive late tonight, especially after midnight. That's when we're going to see the heaviest rain right around 3 to 5 a.m. is that time frame we're really looking at. We'll see cloudy skies tonight in windy conditions. We could see peak wind gusts up to about 45 50 miles per hour and sustained winds up to about 30 miles per hour. But tomorrow for your Monday to start off the week, expect heavy rain during your morning commute. The potential for some strong to severe thunderstorms as well. A high of 62. Those strong winds continue throughout the day. Looking at your nine day forecast, we've got a high of 62 on Monday, but after that cold front moves through the area and clears out, we'll see highs in the 40s and 50s for this week.